Hello guys, so look what we have today. <coughs> A PS5. So it's bush repair as you can see. Okay. And from the back you can see the mess and uh, diode is missing and finally it came to us so that we can fix it okay I will show you the damage under the microscope okay and do you see you like it you don't like it I don't like it it's all burnt oh my god that's bad anyway so what I'm gonna do I'm gonna remove it and then we will solder new one on we will replace the missing diode and hopefully that should see fix the problem okay so I'll do it quickly okay so HDMI port taken out how did I remove it what my other videos it's very easy I just wanted to make the video as short as I can and fortunately all the pads are intact okay now let's give it a clean and then after that we will be tinting the pads let's do this part first here come on come on come on okay uh oh don't move stay there this doesn't matter so we'll give it a little bit of clean come on come on come on, come on. Oh, see that big hole there? Not good, not good. Should be okay. So the next thing is... Isopropyl alcohol. Oh yeah, that's a big hole. Should be okay, should be okay. because there are no other lines running this way because this is just the corner of the board if it was somewhere somewhere else you wouldn't know if any layers you know broken inside if you dig it that way okay we will fix it see it's not nicely intact we will fix it we will fix it Okay. <laughs> Come on, don't. Okay. okay, that looks okay. So now we will solder new HDMI port to see how I put it back watch my previous videos the only thing I have to do now is to make sure isn't it so satisfying you know okay 
see clearly okay no okay let's make it little bit clear for you here so that you can see how to do this micro soldering perfectly professionally uh -huh. All right, now we will give it a clean. There's nothing I can do about that. However, we will check if all the pins are intact nicely. Solid as rock. All good from here and the next thing we have to do is the back diode. I can give it a little bit clean, you know, see this, I don't want to do anything about it, should be okay. Alright. Okay, which way it has to go? Yeah, this way. Okay, and move it from here. Okay, that's all done. Just a little bit of clean, one more time. I'm just checking diode reading. Yeah, they're showing all good. Okay, let's assemble it now. So after replacing the HDMI port and the diode, we still did not have any display. So no display yet. So we know this, uh, someone tried to do it before. So what I would like to do is to check the board around this area and this area. If we can uh, find something why still we do not have a display so let's check it okay first of all let me check this is good this is okay all good There's no component here. OK. 
Okay, look here. See here. Let's go closer. What is it? Little bit of damage here. <laughs> you see? Here. See, it's pulled off. And do you see that mark here? Follow that line. See? Okay. So the person who was fixing this HDMI port, I think he bumped one of his tool. Do you see here? It goes here. See that line here? Goes all the way scratching. See scratched here? All the way here and then pulling up this resistor and stopped here here by this power supply I don't know if any components are being pulled up from here no idea but this one surely is as you can see here I will give you a wider view Yeah, do you see? See a tool gone all the way and then pulling that resistor. So I think if I look closer here yeah, to me it looks like this is no stuff here. And no stuff here, it looks like. See that scratch here? here. So we're gonna put this resistor back and then check. That's enough. Okay, that's done. And now check it again. Let's see if you got the display. Come on. All good.